Welcome, gladiator! The sand of the arena is still fresh. The crowd has gathered. So what are you waiting for? It's time to enter arena and shine in all your glory in the game called Swords and Sandals Immortals. And I must confess, it's the best gladiator game you can ever imagine. So, want to know why? Like this video, subscribe to my channel and let me tell you. The Starbound Gladiator, once a powerful and good hero, now fallen to the darkness, and all he wants now is to destroy Tritonia, and only one, a single gladiator, may face him in battle. And that will be you, my friend. And you will have only 300 days. But let's start from the beginning. The game will meet you with the excellent character creation. Look at all these races. They are so different. They are so amazing. This fellow and even this one. And look, all of them have different bonuses, strong sides and weaknesses. But that's not all, every species, every race can have subclasses and a lot of them and you can customize them a lot, I really mean a lot. Look at that, amazing. In modern days only a few games can have such deep character customization system and that's a huge plus, you really can choose everything. Hey, to pay the voice. <laughs> yeah, fair. Excellent voice. I am impressed, very impressed. Let's move on. You see, that's not all. Now you have to choose your class. And there will be warrior, a wizard, a bard, knight, rogue, and a priest. And all of them have their own playstyle and their own special abilities. You think it over? No, let's continue. So we have to choose our stats. Isn't it amazing? Let's add some defense, intellect, attack and stamina and something like that. So friends, it's really the best character creation I see in the last years. You can customize your hero so much and it will be important cause your hero will be unique and there will be multiplayer in this game and you will be able to fight against real humans, maybe even meet a wizard worm one time cause I plan to play this game a lot. The whole gameplay will be divided on two stages, first is your camp and second is combat itself. Of course you will be able to travel, but mostly you will spend your time here or fighting. So let's take a look at your campfire. This is your base, you will rest here after hard battles and you will be able to buy a weapon or better armor or even train yourself and learn new skills and there will be so many skills and they will be so interesting. Friends, I forget to mention this game is full of humor. Somehow developer managed to combine a very very brutal battles with a lot of humor. <laughs> you see these skills? They are just amazing. And here you can take a look at your hero to see what items you have, what stats do you possess and which talent you can use. There will be a lot of talents from different branches and you will be able to learn them during your level ups. And skill, of course skills. We rested, buy ourselves new weapon, learn a good skills, time to use them, let's go and find someone to fight. And here you see a gladiators you can challenge and this fellow looks exactly like Chewbacca from Star Wars, oh my god. There will be a line here, I already defeated 3 if I remember correctly, I need to defeat one more and then will be a boss fight and I will move to next level. So we can learn information about our enemy, you see my power and enemy power, I am ready to challenge you, let's fight. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
The game will give you last chance to change your mind and run away. And here you can see your stats comparing to enemy. And even weather will matter. Cause some creatures, some races fight better in certain conditions. And now you can see skills and talents. Okay, okay. Let's fight Chewbacca. Combat is the best part of this game, cause it's funny, it's brutal, it's engaging, it's addictive, everything at the same time. And I will move, then my enemy will move. We can see all the stats, our armor, and he is definitely better than me. But not a problem, friends. Do you remember this super skill I learned? Let's try to use them. Oh, devastating. Oh my god, even the piece of his armor fall to the ground. But I have one more very powerful skill. Oh, you don't expect that, didn't you? No, he's too powerful for me. You see, the combat is too ruthless, too brutal. And there will be even more. You will be able literally to chop your opponents apart. And bad side, they will be able to do it with you also. So brutal, oh my god. I bet you will lose this combat. And hey, friends, tell me, do you love such kind of games? Do you want to play it? Leave me a comment, let's see how many gladiators we have here. In general, swords and sandals, immortals, leave a very good impression on me. No matter how hard I try to find something bad in this game, I failed. Everything looks so good. Combat is just wonderful, so brutal and so funny. Art style is just fantastic. Even the camp and character development. Yes, yes, all the talent branches and skills add so many possibilities. You can build a gladiator of your dream. And even this Bruce the Useless, I love him also. So friends, I really hope you don't fall asleep during my review, and if you're still awake, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel, cause I have a lot of good RPG reviews for you, later of course. So I was glad to see you, and I will meet you in my next video.